right, and we are going to try and find a... Actually, while I have a moment. So I don't have a lot of cards. I only have 671. I get most of my cards from trading, and I only open a few packs a week. Um, 132 wins. Probably could be more. I don't play as often as I should, but I do play a lot in real life as well, so... Um, definitely use the online game here for a lot of testing. So, Spirit Tomb versus Reshabor. So, not a super start. Not much I can do about it. We do get the turn one collector. Always handy. And I get to go first. Oh, Yen Mega Cobalion. So, our friend here, more wins. So, Tipig, Tipig. Let's see if we have a Ninetales. Which is right here. So, don't really need a Cleffa. Could be a good free retreater. Could be an easy prize for Yen Mega. A little undecided. So, I think Tepic, Tepic, Tepic is going to be the way to go here. And I'm just going to leave myself in out. So, we'll be able to roast reveal next turn. Not really much I can complain about. We'll see how my opponent gets started. Vile Plume also doesn't scare me at all. My deck has a lot of supporters, and I play Sage, so it actually works quite well under Trainer Lock. So, Yanma, unfortunately not weak to fire. We'll just go ahead and get Nine Tails going. So I'm not afraid to evolve either of my Tepigs into Ability Bore. I'd be really surprised if he plays Catcher. So, nothing there. And, unfortunately, I'm gonna Oak and Hope. I'm gonna save my Sages for the lock if it ever comes. Tuh. Weird decision to make. Man, do I think he plays catcher or not? That's the question. Because if he has a candy vile plume, I'm going to have a hard time evolving. So, I am a gambling man. I will save my fire for re roast reveal on the next turn. Now that I have that switch, I wish I had a Cleffa, but there's not much I can do about it now. So, let's see how he does on his second turn. And I am very glad I played my rare candy. As so, Cabalion can be taken out very easily with any of my Pokemon. So, Roast Reveal. And a lot of very non-helpful cards. So I think I am going to... Let's see here. It's gonna have to two-shot my Rush Ram no matter what. So I think I have some time. that screen back. And the question is, what do I do? I'm not, he's just going to wait for me to take out his Yanma, and then he's going to lock me with Cabalion. And uh, I'm not sure if I'm interested in that. I do need to retreat. Ugh. 
So, uh, lay down a second rush ram. Hmm. And I think we're gonna pass. So he's gonna set up another Oddish. I assume that's for a uh, Blossom. Which is a neat tech in the Vile Plume deck. Never seen it before, Cities. One of the top cut videos it was played, and uh, I thought it was brilliant. Fortunately, I'm going to one hit KO everything on his field, and uh, healing that one damage a turn ain't going to do a thing. So, Roast Reveal. Sage. Look at that. Super easy decision. And that's why Sage is so good. Wish I could have got a fire so I could retreat Reshram and Eek. But hey, I cannot complain. Let's count the fire. One, two, three. Yeah. We got Fisherman. We're going to be in good shape. He can't one-hit KO me, and I can one-hit KO him. So I'm gonna den I'll am gonna. i just be able to retreat, and this won't really be a huge deal. Um, so we end our turn. He'll get a knockout, and I'm fine with that. We have Fisherman. We have Ability Embor. We are happy. Alrighty, so the... Yep, we can one hit everything. He'll be able to get a cheap prize with Yan Mega. So... One, two, three, four, which is perfect. And let's see. So, it's not even going to be able to get Cabalion ready for another lock. I've got my second. No, I don't have a second rush ram. What am I talking about? Um. So, actually, 80 times 2, that's a thinker right there. He crash is not enough. Nah, I don't have another ability board ready, so... And I think I discarded one if I remember correctly. reveal so fisherman energy life is good hmm. the question is nah, Zion Meg is gonna go down though so the damage on my tepic isn't gonna be a huge deal so fresh ram gets promoted <clears throat> And we'll go ahead and blue flare. And take our first prize. I assume if he has a copycat, he'll be able to go after that cleffa. It may actually be hard to match hand sizes. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I've got one, two, three, four, five. Out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So this should put him up to ten. So you'll be able to match hand sizes.
And while he thinks, I'm going to count energy. Three. The fourth in my hand. Fifth on rush ramp. So we still have five fire and three double colorless hiding around. So he does what I expect. We'll go ahead and roast reveal. See if we can't get at some of that energy that's eluding us. That sucks. Three trainers. But it's going to make it even yeah, harder for him to match hand sizes. He was not able to get energy on Cobalion, so we're in good shape. Fandango them back on. Um, and we'll just go ahead and outrage for another, or blue flare for another knockout. So it's two to two, but I have to say I am much happier with where I'm at versus where he's at, so. Let's see if he gets a metal onto Cobalion. And he fills his bench, so he's not gonna be able to fire up another Cobalion. And swarming me with Yan Megas is not gonna be good enough. So he does put a rescue on Cobalion. So he will have another one, but getting three energy on there is just gonna take a long time. So he must have undid, undid the rescue. Come on, game. Yep, undid the rescue, went ahead with the... And he just passes. 16 cards in my dick. At this point, I'm not really feeling any pressure. I'm completely content with blue flaring. His Yanma. Retreating my. Yeah, Flare Blitz. And let's see. I'm a little scared that I may have a Fisherman prized. So. Are we content? I could really use a double color list so the Flare Blitz is ready to go on the next turn. There's the double colorless. Burn tower, can't argue with that. Yeah, I'm happy. So, he only has one energy in his deck. Not that concerned. I'm gonna wait before I lay my stadium. Or did I discard my stadium? Oh, there it is. Do my manual attachment for the turn. Nah, I think we're just gonna surprise him. Nah, I think it is too important to get the burn tower this turn. So, blue flare. go for the iron breaker which I'm totally fine with so he whiffs on his burn tower as well all right so we really need a heads right here right now fail so I don't have enough energy to flare blitz and retreat. So we got one, two, three, four. So the question becomes, ah, oh, let's see, four, five, six, seven. Well, let's go for it. Stop. 
still don't have enough to do everything that I need to do. Eh, get the pig knight, that's helpful. Now we have everything that we need. Fortunately, we had to discard. Alrighty, two cards. We've got an oak, so uh, I think we're going to be okay here. Actually, I could just continue my outrage path. I don't need to make this more complicated than it needs to be. Let's see, but that outrage will come in handy, that's for sure. So, Reshram or Embor? I think we'll save Embor. So I'm definitely concerned here that I may run out of steam. Really need that fisherman to get some energy back. We are down to two prizes. We have a double colorless. We have a rush ram with plenty of energy on it to outrage. Five, six, seven, eight. So there's Cabalion. Wonder if he'll remember to burn tower. Oh, that's right, he's not gonna actually be able to attack. He's never gonna be able to match my hand size. One, two, three, seven, eight, nine. We are out of fire energy. So we desperately need a fisherman. Let's see if the final card in my hand is a card left. That is a shame. Alrighty. Outrage will have to do. Nah. Retreat. Rush ram. Fandango on to Reshram. We're gonna go for it all here. Two prizes. Because I can't use a fisherman and an oak on the same turn. So he's gonna be able to do 40 damage. It's not enough. was a fisherman, which may break his heart. Mm. 
And we'll see if he concedes before I get to blue flare. Come on. Except the fisherman. Let's message him. So, this was a good match. Came down to the wire. And we won't waste any more time. Blue Flare for our sixth prize and the win. did notice at the end there he did have a blossom so I think that's gonna start becoming popular in vile plume decks um, it's a good card so 1020 damage which I'm pretty sure is my record but uh, we are hitting for weakness so that is Reshabor versus Cobalion Yanmega vile plume